What's up metalheads? My name's Jamie. This is the Blades and EDC channel. And if you're new here, please consider subscribing. If uh, you enjoy the video, hit that like button. Uh, today we're going to take a look at one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight Civivi knives that are in the upcoming knife cell that goes live on Patreon on September the 2nd and on YouTube on September the 3rd. Patreon is linked in the description if you want to take a look. Patrons get 24 hours early access, and depending on your tier, you do get discounts. All right, first up, we have the Civivi Chevalier. The wood version, uh, I can't remember what wood this is. I want to say African Rosewood, or Gia Borsha Wood. Beautiful knife, in excellent shape. Um, extremely sharp. It has had a quick stud put on it. I have arthritis, so uh, the fuller was a little tough for me to get to. So I did put a quick stud on there. I'm looking for if the quick stud left any marks on the blade. I don't see any marks. Sometimes they can scratch the blade, but I don't see any scratches, so I'm going to call it clean. The wood handles are in beautiful condition. And this does come in the box just like it would if you bought it new. So that's the Civivi Chevalier. Next up, we have the Civivi Backlash. This is the polished Damascus version. Beautiful, beautiful finish on that Damascus on this knife. Great EDC knife. Blade shape, deep hollow grind on that blade. Very ergonomic. Ford finger choil. Very comfortable. Good looking knife. Generally not the biggest fan of Damascus, but man, when it's polished like this, it just looks so good. It almost looks like damask steel, but this isn't damask steel. And I've heard nothing bad about Civivi's Damascus, so... It's hard to get, get those patterns to show up on camera. Alright, that is the Civivi Backlash. Next up, we have a Civivi Praxis. Um, this is one that's well known in the community also. Very popular Civivi knife. Got some smudges on there. Get them all wiped off. This one comes with the box also, so does this one. So does this one. Just like if you were to buy it new, and it is in light new condition. Although I do see a couple marks on the blade, so I'm not going to call it light new condition. Or is that just where I wiped it? Hold on. Maybe there's not a mark on the blade. There is no mark on that blade. That was just where I wiped oil and made a line. Because it's gone now. Yeah. This thing's pretty much brand new. It has the gold liners, which looks pretty slick. Good looking knife. Another one with great ergonomics. Ford finger choil. Bigger knife like both of these, but not too heavy like both of these. Very cool knife. All right. Next up, we have a Civivi Elementum. This is the wood version. I need to wipe that oil off real fast. This is the... Uh, this one is in D2 steel. Oh, I should have told you steel on these. This one is, well, where's my spreadsheet at? It's written on there and it's so damn small I can't read it. And I do have my glasses on in case you're wondering. Um, this one was, I can't remember what the Chevalier is either, but I will tell you what both are in a moment. Come on, Excel. Open up. Did I not open it? Yeah, I opened it. All right. Uh, it's actually another Civivi I forgot about till just now. Um, the Civivi Praxis is 9CR18 MOV still. And the Civivi Backlash 
is polished Damascus. I don't, it's just Damascus. I don't know what, what it is. And the Chevalier, which wasn't on my spreadsheet yet. I wasn't sure I was going to sell it or not. And I decided to sell it. Bear with me. As usual, I am unprepared. Uh, the Civivi Chevalier comes in 14C28N, I believe. Yes, 14C28N, Damascus, 9CR, 18MOV, D2 on the Elementum. Everybody knows Elementum. Great little knives. It's the flipper version. Not, not the button lock version. There's another button lock in, in the uh, cell though, coming up shortly, uh, which I'll actually go ahead and do it now. The Civivi Cogent with the partially serrated blade. And this is 14C28N also. Um, wipe that blade down a little bit. Beautiful knife, great action. Comes with the box. No lock stick. No lock stick on the Chevalier either. Okay. Next up, the next four do not come with a box, just so you know. Just get the knife alone, it'll be in a uh, like a bubble wrap bag. This is the Civivi Mini Asticus. I mean, I'll, I need a Mini Asticus. I prefer a full size Asticus. But hollow grind, this is the brass scaled version, so you do get a little bit of weight in this. It feels substantial in hand, it feels pretty good in hand. Has seen a little use, but it's been taken well, well taken care of. You can tell by looking at it, it's in pretty good shape. Got a couple marks here and there on the scales. Nothing too major. The blade looks really good. The edge is really good. The Civivi Mini Asticus. So we've got a Mini Asticus. We may well may as well have a big Asticus. So here's the full size Asticus. Civivi really needs to go back to doing more hollow grinds, man. I don't know why they don't. A lot of their older knives have hollow grinds. They don't do them much anymore. This is a good looking knife. This one looks pretty much brand new. I don't see any flaws at all on it. This is D2 still. This one, uh, I have to look at spreadsheet. I can't read that tiny writing. This That one is um, 10 CR 15 MOV. 10 CR 15 C O M O V. These damn blade stills, man. I tell you, this one is D2, the full size Asticus. It's a big knife, man. It's a big one, for sure. It's a big one. All right, next up we have the Civivi Ortis. Beautiful blue on this one. Good blade shape on this one too. Another hollow grind. It's a lot of hollow grinds here. Hollow grind. Hollow grind, hollow grind, hollow grind. No box with this one either. So the last four you're seeing do not come with a box, just so you guys are aware. But they will be sent in a protected uh, bubble envelope, so. They'll arrive safe and sound. Light sun, is that a? Scratch or is that me wiping? Nah, it's me wiping. No scratch. I don't see any scratches on the blade at all. Looks brand new to me. Blue G10. Good looking knife. And this one is 9CR18 MOV still. And last, but certainly not least, is the Hadros. 
Civivi Hadros, Hadros, a Mallory design Civivi. Sweet looking knife, another hollow grind. Clean that up. I've been looking over these knives and fidgeting with them a little bit and checking the action out and get my fingerprints all over them. We're looking good now. Good looking knife here. Very, very comfortable in hand. That blade shape is going to be fantastic for EDC tasks. Just your normal everyday tasks. This one has 10 CR, 15 CO MOV still also. And these are my Carta handles on this one. G10 here, G10 here. Brass, G10, wood, G10, G10, wood. All right, so those are all the Civivis that are in the upcoming knife sale. I think it's all the Civivis. If I left one out, don't don't hold it against me. There's a lot of knives here, so it's possible I missed one, but I don't think I did. I think I got them all. Uh, I'm going to look over here and make sure one more time. Yeah, I don't see any more Civivis, so that should be it for the Civivis. If you have any questions about any of these knives, comment below and let me know. Um, I did rele release a uh, knife sale preview video which shows a spreadsheet with the pricing for all the knives. So the pricing is out there and if you're a patron I did upload the spreadsheet to Patreon. Unfortunately I can't upload a spreadsheet to YouTube. So And patrons did get access to that spreadsheet 24 hours before it went live on Patreon or on, the, on YouTube. So um, yeah. Just like with the sale, patrons will get 24 hour early access to the sale. Um, so keep that in mind if you're considering buying any of these knives. And uh, yeah, lots of cool knives available. We got something for every budget, something for every size. Whether you, you like them small or you like them large, got one for everybody. So, all right guys, thank you so much for watching. If you enjoyed the video, hit that like button, subscribe if you are new, and I will see you on the next one.